Okay, it's time to party. Time to go to a party. I love depleting the natural resources of every planet I come across. It feels really morally great. There's so many like words that I've only read and I don't know how to pronounce them, and this planet is one of them. I think I usually say like Beaconstein in my head. But I don't know if that's what it is. Looking good, Miss Allison Gunn. Hawk won't be able to keep his eyes off you. I used to not ever be able to get I assume Allison Gunn is my cover. You run a small but talented band of mercs out in the Terminus systems. Precisely the type of person Hawk respects. I took the liberty of giving you a reputation. Papers, witnesses, article in Badass Weekly. Just don't start talking business with him, and you'll be fine. Remind me, what kind of man are we dealing with? Hawk's a weapons dealer and smuggler. He killed my partner and stole his gray box. Other than that, he's not so bad. Rich, charismatic, willing to crack open a man's skull and get some accent. implants inside. Take it I'm wearing this get-up for a reason? You look really out of place at a society party in armor, don't you think? You look great. You should wear this stuff more often. Uh, I agree. Now's probably a good time to fill me in on the details. You have been waiting patiently. Our friend Hawk is throwing a party for his closest friends. The high A couple dozen of the worst great. liars, Wish cheaters, that. and mass murderers you'll ever want to meet. This is All even more heisty. As a tribute to the man himself. We should have been able to bring it. Our tribute is a lovely statue of your old friend Saren, rendered with loving detail and filled to the brim with our weapons and armor. I love when they you say rendered with loving detail and it's, it's like the most they low poly looking thing. Once inside, we'll make our way to Hawk's vault door, somewhere in the back of the ballroom. Then we case the security and start peeling away the layers. The statue should be there, waiting for you to crack it open and arm up. Then we just waltz into the vault and take back KG's gray box. And I'll finally get a chance to say goodbye. What's in the gray box that makes it worth all this trouble? The gray box holds KG's memories. Everything from all the codes and plans he stole to... all the time we spent together. Wrapped up in those memories is the secret he stole. KG never told me what it was. But the information got him killed. This ought to be interesting. That's what I'm going for. This is our stop. After you, Ms. Gunn. Hold a moment, I love her back in the There seems stress. to be an issue with the statue. Is there a problem here? No, Mr. Hawk. Just doing a scan. I don't believe we've met. Donovan Hawk. Allison Gunn. A pleasure. Sir, the scanners aren't picking anything up. Hmm. I don't think our guests would come all the way here from Ilium just to cause trouble. Do you? I don't know. <laughs> you may pass through, Ms. Gunn. 
You were invited after all, but I will ask your companion to remain outside. You understand, I hope. If it makes you feel more secure, she can wait outside. Good to see we're not going to have a problem. Enjoy the party. Well, that didn't go as I expected. It would have been cool if they had given Kasumi, like, an actual outfit. They could have still, like, incorporated her hood and all that stuff into it. Didn't, it wouldn't have to be, like, suddenly a completely different look for her, but, like, at least something that looked like she was going to a party and wasn't a master thief trying to break in. <laughs> Any idea why he'd send you away? No. We've never seen each other in person, and no one knows what I look like. Just watching his ass, I'm sure. I can't blame him. Don't worry about it. I can handle it from here. That's good, because you'll have to do all the talking. I'll uh -oh. stay out of sight and stick with you. She's the like, best wait, I can. never mind. We'll keep radio contact in case something goes wrong. We need to find the door and case the security. We'll figure out the next step then. How did you ever contain that situation on the hall? Oh, that? A quick application of force, a little pressure, and bam! Done. Thank goodness. I thought those rabble would dog you for years. My favorite guy at this party is the vampire. This guy. He has... very, very pale skin and looks like he has red eyes. Or pink eyes. And, uh, really really flat hair. Classic vampire, right? They always grease their hair too much, flatten it too much. What's your read on that Archangel guy? I hear he's dead. Or gone or something. Good riddance, I say. That's Varric's voice actor. Doesn't move his lips when he talks. I wish you could mingle a little bit more. I guess they do that though in the Citadel DLC. And that's too much mingling. There should be like an in-between amount of mingling. Very nice. There's more here than I expected. <laughs> She's like, I'm Passive still mad at you. Voice lock, kinetic barrier, DNA scanner. Looks like an EX700 series. Everything a vault needs to be impenetrable. This gonna be a problem? Please, remember who you're talking to. We'll need to get a voice sample for the voice lock. You'll have to go chat up Hawk for that. We'll have to find a password too. DNA? Child's play. We should find plenty of DNA samples in Hawk's private quarters. And the barrier? Cut the power. Never fails. If we can find it. KG could get through a system like this in his sleep. And I'm better. Let's get to it. There's something so great about how um, Kasumi like obviously respects Keiji, but is also like I was better at him than at stealing than him. It looks there's like no the like there's the no hedging the floor here. I'll set about his talent or her talent. Some say Commander Shepard is still alive. Ha! Bah humbug. Oh, please. It's wishful thinking, at best. Let's see if I can see her boobs. Being rude. They're in there. That door goes to a security room. I'll take care of the lock. There we go. Ready when you are. You can't be back here. Take him down! Here they come! Can't do it! I have an idea. See what you can find. Perugia. Got something? The password is Perugia. Huh. 
That's the name of the man who stole the Mona Lisa. Nice. I tapped into their communications. Maybe it'll come in handy. We still need that voice sample from Hawk. You can talk to him. Actually, first, let's look over here. One sec. That's he really bothers me that that doesn't. They don't make an effort to put the TV back or whatever. It's like, okay, just let everyone know that you someone found that system. I hear Mr. Hawk's vault is exquisite. Who could know? He never lets anyone near it. Chief Rowe, huh? She sounds like a hard ass. I'm sure this information will come in handy. Got some weird looking eyelids when she looks down, huh? After you. Miss Gunn, good to see you. That scene at the door hasn't soured your evening, I hope. There's always someone gunning for people like you and me. Good one. Gunning. <laughs> yes. Allison Gunn. That's true. She's so funny. I'm glad you understand. Frankly, I'm surprised your security isn't tighter. It's a ballsy move opening your front door like this. Yes, I suppose it is. Hopefully it sends the message that I don't fear anyone stupid enough to step up to me. People these days want comfort, entertainment, love. They don't see that the galaxy is fragile. They only have to worry about simple luxuries. Why? Because people like me and you are doing the terrible things that keep the galaxy spinning. This party is for us, the cleaners. The support structure for the galaxy's gleeful delusions of peace. May there always be a market for the things we do. Wow. Incredible. I said get him talking, and you got him talking. We've got enough of a voice sample. Let him go. Enjoy the party, Miss Gunn. Let's go crack that voice scanner. I always thought he ha he was supposed to have a a pretty bad uh, Scottish accent, and but I've been informed that it's supposed to be South African, but it's still bad. Mr. Hawk's private rooms are off limits to guests without security clearance. I have clearance to go in. On whose authority? <laughs> I love that expression. I have authorization from Chief Rowe. Okay, one second. Chief Rowe, Samuels. Have you given access authorization to Mr. Hawk's private rooms? They have access, Samuels. They'll stop bothering me. Got it. Sorry to bother you, ma'am. Okay, you're clear to go in. Enjoy the party. I often will kind of waffle about how she gets in, whether she does this or goes in this way. And I think sometimes, oh, she would just go in this way because she's so direct. Look for but then I'm also like, DNA from. she's an just infiltrator. That's literally her class. And obviously that is more to do with her fighting style and not like... Ha! Found a sample? No, a credit shit. Empty. Too bad. A cigarette butt would have been a good source. I, I think it's funnier though if she like DNA has to like play looks nice. Looks like Hawk's been trying to crack Cagey's gray box. Looks like he's missing something. He hasn't cracked the encryption yet. Not a great saliva sample, but it's still useful. 
We're going to need more than this for the scanner, though. Okay, we're in his bedroom, right? So let's look for some used tissues. It's clean. It's, it's a plant. plant. The cleaners don't dare touch treasures like this. We can get some skin cells from the dust. It's probably contaminated, though. We should find another sample. We can probably get Hawk's DNA off the data pad. Uh -oh. He seems to have obsessed over this. That should do it. Let's get out of here. Look at that. It, my secret is revealed that I did delete her butt. So it wouldn't clip through the dress. to save it. That got it. The barrier's down. Password required. Perusia. Voice ID accepted. Welcome, Mr. Hawk. I'm surprised I even needed his voice at all, considering I feel like at this point, like, deep fake technology would be really confirmed. effective. Welcome, Mr. Hall. Although then again, we'd probably up security so to combat that. He's will he's rich, I'll check so. for security cams. Go ahead and get dressed. Just like, thank god. Okay, that's something I never get in like movies or this. When people stand in front of a security camera before like disabling it with like tech or you know like shooting it or something like that. But it's like but they've they have an image still of the person like before that, right? So like they don't have anything after that, but like they still have the person. So this is Hawk's fault. Very nice. This scanner will hone in on the gray box. It's not far. Michelangelo's David. Just... Wow. Think we could get this out through the door? I think we should try. There are some honestly pretty ugly statues. They look like, um... Hawk has good They look taste. like just like plaster. Before you sand it, after you've made a mold of plaster, huh. then you have to sand it, but you haven't that sanded it yet. Mean. I guess everything's valuable to someone. This looks like quarry script. Wow. This has got to be old. When was the last time the quarians wrote on stone? Creepy. I could still get money for something like this, even outside the Alliance. Asari go nuts for this sort of thing. See, this one is better rendered. This one looks more like stone. How did Hawk get Lady Liberty's head? Damn you, Hawk! That's... impressive. Not sure what it is, though. This looks like quarry in script. Oh, I already did that one. Wow. This has got to be old. When was the last time the quarians wrote on stone? Doesn't look like much, but that might be one of the most valuable pieces here. Turian art is rare outside of Palavin. That would be cool to see um, more stuff like that. More like art 
from all these cultures. That's just it's all different. This is nice. Oddly relaxing. Is that supposed to be a reference to something? Because I don't know what that would be. Wow. Imagine that thing coming at you in a dark alley. See, that's literally, I think, the same model they use in Dragon Age 2 when Sandal freezes a, freezes an ogre in the Deep Roads. Pretty sure this is the exact same model, except different color. A model of the Kara. It's like a Turian Titanic, the way I hear it. That's a Casa Locust. No, THE Casa Locust. The gun that killed two presidents. Gorgeous. It even comes with a perfect copy, too. I'm sure Hawk won't mind if we borrow these. I'll take it. Oh my god. There it is. Don't bother Miss Goto. It's cold locked. <gasps> Does he have just like I had a, a screen there the just in case someone breaks into really his vault? You get through anyway. You know me. I don't like to disappoint. I need what's in your grey box, Kasumi. You know I'm willing to kill you for it. I'll admit your skills are impressive. You got into my vault like I'd left it open, but you're still going to die. No! Have I got your attention? That shut him up. Kill them! You broke his vase. That's the last straw. You see that? Blueprints. There's a landing pad to the east. Let's get out of here. Joker, bring the shuttle in. Now!
trying to see me. Another way. Down you go. Get ready. Can you not do that? Okay. I wasn't sure. Actually, you know what? That'd probably be really bad for everyone if I did that. I always thought that he knew, figured, like, he either knew or figured out who Shepard was. But clearly he thinks that it's a woman named Allison Gunn who's in Badass Weekly <laughs> until the end. Okay, I'm just gonna stop being lazy and actually use a proper weapon. Finally. Sheesh. Oh my god. 
<laughs> that was really close. <laughs> Sorry, Kasumi, I didn't realize you were down. Kasumi's such a good character for being a DLC character. Like, she's got like a great, fun kind of personality you see day to day, but like, you get these really well done peeks into, into a more serious and like passionate person. Not that she doesn't seem like she's capable of that normally, but like, they do a good job of kind of making it clear that she hides behind kind of a fun-loving exterior and that she doesn't really let anyone in. Like Kelly says that, but she didn't really need to say that because they actually write it pretty well. This should come in handy. Keep them busy. I'll take care of this myself. Here they come. <laughs> so bad at aiming. Damn it. <laughs> I never considered if Beatrix is partial to fire, but I feel like she might be considering considering that's her one of her most used powers. Also, you know, she's like a fiery person. She probably really likes when things are on fire. Probably part of her is just like really happy about it. Yeah, that's a quick reacting gun. Incoming, pitch down. You could have done this the easy way, Gojo. Allow me to show you the hard way. Look left. Missed again. <laughs> Missed again, oh my god. Missed again, oh my god. Thank you, Kasumi. Picking up my slack. Your 
Are they over here? What did you tell your friend, Kasumi? You're doing this for love? Guns is back and with full shield. If I can get to the ship, I can take down the shield. Sucks that KG died by his hand. He sucks. At least you could get killed by someone like. Cool. I love the next part when she smiles in the next cutscene. It's very fitting for her character. <laughs> so cute. Look straight ahead. Careful, men. What the keeper could be fighting? Dead. They're coming from the front. I don't listen to any of her directions because they never are the truth. Loser. You know, it's especially embarrassing when you've been blown up in your ship because you're hiding in your ship and you still die. I love the, the coloring in this mission. we found is all here. It's big, Kasumi. If the Council ever got wind of this, 
The Alliance could be implicated. Kasumi, I... I encrypted the information to keep it safe. And the I Alliance? The oh, key to your why do we want to hide it? So no one could get the whole package. But if I'm dead, and if anyone knows about this, then I've made you a target, my love. I'm so... so sorry. Keiji. I know you, Kasumi. You'll want to keep these memories forever. But you don't need some neural implant to know I'll always be with you. Please, Kasumi, destroy these files. There's nothing more I can do to protect you. I... I can't do that. This is all that's left. Goodbye, Kasumi. I love you. That's so sad. I do wish his voice acting was a little bit more animated, but... Is there any way we can just destroy the information? No. Keiji's a master at encrypting files. He lays the information into his memories. You can't get one without experiencing the other. It's so sad. Hawk knew you had the cipher. I'm sure others do too. It's only a matter of time before someone finds you and the secret gets out. You're right. I know. I just... It feels like I'm losing him. Again. You have to do this, Kasumi. You know that. I... Gomen Nasai. Keiji-san. This mission has everything. It has a heist, has dressing up at a party, going undercover, and it has really devastating undertones and an ending. Oh God, Beatrix, quick! Commander, you received. Get out of that outfit. Terminal. Get out of the outfit. Let no one see you. She would never let anyone see her on the bridge in this outfit. <laughs> I have to um, fix it again and save it in her because I don't actually have the or the jacket. All right, that was that. <laughs>